how to get a little bit better using Wolf's Law. Dr. Julius Wolf was a surgeon in the early 19th century, and what he discovered was his concept of bone remodeling. And what he discovered was that when bones were put under stress, that this bone remodeling happened much more effectively and efficiently and ultimately strengthened bones. That's right, strengthened bones. Now, we may, you may have heard about this as it relates to muscles. For example, you tear your muscles down when you work out and they grow back stronger. This applies to bones. Of course, you don't want to break a bone necessarily, although in some circles, people say that when a bone breaks and heals properly, it grows back even stronger, although that seems to have been disputed by many scientists. So what does this whole idea about Wolf's Law really mean to you? Well, number one, it helps to do exercise and things of that nature and put your bones under stress so, you can, so they can stay strong. Astronauts suffer this when they're in space at zero gravity. There's no stress on their bones and thus they begin to lose some bone density if they're up there for an extended period of time. But what it really means to you today, this minute, is that you're probably not going to go do some space traveling today. What it means is to, in order to get a little bit better, you've got to apply a little bit of stress. Now, we know that when you put yourself under stress, it doesn't always feel that good. In fact, we can avoid stress. Uh, sometimes we get so comfortable in our lives and our routines and the processes we do day to day, everything just kind of becomes transparent to us in terms of what a challenge is and we fall into these routines and we stop putting ourselves under stress and thus we don't grow. But you can avoid this by just beginning to think about a couple of things. Number one, recognize that your learning can be through play and it can be through just going about your day to day and experiencing new things. But if you're willing to put yourself under a little stress and to push number two, which is your comfort zone. So identify what your learning edge is, identify what your comfort zone is. And then number three, the third step in this is be willing to go 10% harder or longer or faster just to experiment to see what that's like. Now, it may not feel very good, right? But going a little bit harder on that project, trying to accelerate a process you're doing, maybe taking a new step that's out of your comfort zone, all represent bringing Wolf's Law into your day-to-day -day, and that can accelerate your growth and help you perform just a little bit better.